We are doing our part to help raise money and awareness for childhood cancer. And joining us right now to tell us all about Chase After a Cure are some very special guests, Whitney and Chase Ringler. How are you all? Doing good. good. It's wonderful to see you. You're doing well, Chase? That's so good to hear. Can you tell me a little bit about Chase's story? I mean, there's a lot of people in the Low Country that already know who Chase is, but kind of how it got started. Sure. In, um, in 2007, October 2007, he was three years old, and he was diagnosed with stage four cancer called neuroblastoma. Uh, prior to that, he was a perfectly healthy child. Um, he experienced a little bit of limping for a couple weeks. That was kind of my only clue um, that anything was wrong with him. And um, upon... Um, Finding the tumor, we also found that it had spread. It was on his skull, and his bone, bone marrow was 95% tumor. Yeah. Um, he was given a 30% chance of survival at that point. Um, he had surgery to remove the tumor, which uh, he also lost his kidney at the, during the surgery. Uh, he had eight rounds of chemo, a bone marrow transplant, 14 rounds of radiation, and 11 rounds of very painful antibody therapy. And so how, how old are you right now, Chase? Eight. So at the age of eight, you've already gone through all of this. Mm-hmm. Uh, you, are, you are really an amazing child, but you know that, right? Yeah. <laughs> people tell you that all the time. Yeah. And I guess, Whitney, what's so important, not just that people know Chase's story, but they know that there's other children like Absolutely. Chase. Absolutely. And, um, you know, Chase was given a 30% chance of survival, um, and most kids do not survive. He is, he is one of the very few. And it is very important that um, money is raised for childhood cancer research. There's very, very little funding out there available for it. It's the clinical trials that saved his life. Mm -hmm. and. Those options need to be there for these other children, and we need to find treatments for children who relapse because currently there is no, uh, there is no cure. Yeah. And how is Ch how are you doing right now, Chase? You feeling good? Tell her what happened in December. You had your last set of what? Scans. Yeah, he had his last set of scans. In December. In this past December. That's yeah. so great, Chase. And there's a reason why we're here today, not just for you, Chase, but for the other kids that suffer for ne from neuroblastoma. And there's a great event coming up. That's why we have this beautiful necklace yes. right here. So let's tell everybody how we can help out. So we're having our fourth annual Chase After Cure Gala. It's presented by Spark and GE Power and & Water and the Exchange Club of Charleston. It's February 25th at 7 p.m. at the Charleston Marriott. Mm -hmm. We have live and silent auctions. Um, tickets are $100, and we, it's dinner is provided by Macintosh, Hall's Chop House, Rue de Jean, um, Wentworth Grill, Sapphire Grill. Desserts mm -hmm. are provided by Oak and Amelia Claire's Bakery That's and more. That's amazing. So it's, a, it's, a, it's an awesome event. And um, Colucci's Jewelers of Somerville um, has donated this diamond necklace. It's a $2,300 necklace. And um, we have a key tree where you purchase a, a key off this tree. This necklace will be in a little um, chest, and if your key opens that chest, you win this necklace. That's wonderful. So it's, it's a really fun event. Um, we've got Calvin Taylor Band. We've got a DJ. Um, it's it's going to be really exciting. Pretty and, much anything yeah. and everything you'd like to do. Anything will Chase everything. be there? He will. He'll be there for a little while. It's, okay. It's an adult event. Yeah. Uh, but. He comes and he makes his appearance. Because I'm certain that there's yes. so many people out there that do want to meet him. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, Chase, you are very yeah. amazing. Like I said, I'm sure that you already know that. People tell you all the time, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite thing to do? Because I saw you doing it in the green room. Play your play, game? Play my PSP. And you're really good at it. I would imagine so. Well, it's so great to meet you, Chase. Thank you so very much, Thank Whitney, you. for being with us. We'll definitely have all this information on our website at abcnews4.com. All you got to do is click on the Low Country Live tab. Go there and find out more information about Chase and how you can help Chase after a cure. Thank you so very much. Thank you. All right, well, we're back with more Low Country Live coming up right after this break. Stay with us.